was loud. Give me Oh, hell no. Oh my god. Welcome back to my daily grind. Create yourself is what you'll find me doing every day and every night. No time to lose. One day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome back to the vlog. It is Tuesday, another day, another chance to push hard. And the topic for this vlog is door lock progress. So let's get it. But before we get started, love goes out to all my subscribers. Thank you for making my life special and worth a living to the max. So let me try to give back with a sweet, sweet video. So to recap, I hacked my doorknob and my handle. You can check it out in this vlog. So that's done. Now I can actuate it like this. It's kind of hard, but it works. Well then, that was... The next thing that I did, I received my end mills yesterday and well, I put one of them to good use. Here is the time lapse. So yeah, that was me carving out this nameplate and inside this nameplate is the reader. Then I drilled out a hole and well, these are the cables from the reader. <laughs> So far, so good, right? And this is the motor progress, just a simple angle that's the 3D printed, well, T piece, I would like to say. Glued in gear. So this one is the fixed one, and this one is, you know, this one has a bit of play, so I think it's a good combination. The pins, they point to the right side, and I think that's a, <laughs> that could be a mistake. But yeah, so far, That's that, so now all that's left is the electronics and uh, the switches and all of that good stuff. Check this out. This is so freaking perfect. This is a slightly bigger cable canal than these that I will use for, you know, for the rest of my flat. <laughs> Check this out. This is so freaking perfect because an Arduino Uno fits in there freaking perfectly. It is crazy. Yeah, this will make it easy to wall mount everything. Maybe like that, maybe like that. And now all that I need to do is to come up with a, well, with plates for these open sides. For myself, these smaller cable canals, they will go from here to there, something like that. So yeah, plates and then wall mounting it. Well, actually, let's freaking try the power of video. Believe it or not, it is already the next day. Most cumbersome project ever. <laughs> okay, I tried to connect the reader. No reader detected, no reader detected. And I wasted more than an hour on this issue. Testing the wires, rewiring it, doing all sorts of stupid things. But then suddenly I realized my mistake. I forgot about these two switches. These tiny switches right here. And you can choose the protocol, SPI, I2C, whatever. So I was like, oh. Oh my god, I finally found a mistake. Disassemble everything again. Switch it over to the other position. Put it all back together just to find out, just to realize that it is not possible to get readings through aluminum. <laughs> it was so hard for me. Meanwhile, I came up with this thing, a 3D printed door plate, and this will probably work. Rip, low profile. Now it's like, oh, what the hell is this? A blank door plate? What the hell? Like, I don't know, whatever. Also, check out the plates. This is looking, yeah, it's not looking too bad, I guess. The 15% infill variations, they look a bit weird with this mesh in here, so I went for the 100% infill variations. There is a, don't know why that happened. But anyways, so now I have plates, also for the small table canal, looking promising. Okay, so let's at least try to get this reader working and then I will call it a vlog. This is literally killing me. Let's get this plate going. Please, please, please work. Yes. Oh boy. Well, okay, there it is. Definitely looking a bit different. 
Not my proudest print, but it should do the job. I might get to exchange this one day, but probably not. Who cares? Let's test it. Hell yeah, this is looking good. Looking good, looking good. And now... Oh my god. <laughs> it's not working. Please. Why? It's still not working. What? Okay, never mind, it's working now. As you can see, or maybe not. But yeah, it's whatever. It's, it's freaking me out. This is looking hella clean. Let's go. Nice. I just hooked it all up. Let's freaking try. The only problem is, hmm, I need to lock it. Then I need to go out, <laughs> out of this door, then unlock it. Okay. Let's go. The final freaking test for today. Let's get it. Wow, it's loud. Hell yes. All that's left is to, you know, renovate this and then get a power supply for the whole flat. So yeah, easy. It's currently unlocked. Let's lock it. I think I'm currently using a bit, well, I'm using too many steps. Let's unlock it. I'm currently using two and a half revolutions. I think two and just a tiny bit should be more than enough. Currently. What the hell was that? Did you see that? The hell? Well, it's locked now. What, what the hell? Alrighty, let's try two revolutions and just a bit. Yeah, this is, this is looking good. <laughs> okay, and the only thing, let's make it faster by... Okay, well, let's... Let's go for 500 right there, instead of a thousand. <laughs> okay, this is hella amazing. <laughs> and it's actually getting quieter. This is sweet. Oh my God, we had 1000 right there. Let's go for 100. Oh my God, please do not explode. Okay, never mind. That was, that, that was a fail right there. Let's try 300 then. Okay, never freaking... Oh, hell no. Oh my god. Stop. Okay, 400 seems to be the perfect value right there. Okay, one last time because this is just too freaking amazing. Tag right here. Oh my god, this is so cool. Let's go one more time. Let's go. Okay, so here we go. This is actually hella amazing. This gets me pumped up. Again, before I'm able to finish this project, I still need to get down the frame. Also get myself a current supply for the flat, five volts, 12 volts, DC conversion. <sighs> But yeah, that's more than just a proof of concept. This is actually freaking working and it is awesome. So yeah, that's enough progress for today. Smash that like button the way this tiny motor smashes open the door lock. Bang the bell like crap. Never miss NFC door lock updates. Check the recent news on chrisviron.com. And yeah, that's it for today. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>